Good afternoon, and thank you for joining us here at Act Expo. I'm Patrick McDonald King. I'm the CEO of GreenLane. Our vision is to build a nationwide network of public high-speed charging and hydrogen refueling stations for the commercial transportation industry. We're backed by industry leaders Daimler Trucks, Nextera Energy Resources, and BlackRock, and we're committed to accelerating the transition to zero emission freight transportation through a data-driven corridor strategy. And we couldn't be more thrilled to be here today to make a couple of announcements before we take you forth with the show. First off, we're thrilled to announce last Thursday, we officially opened our first Green Lane location in Colton, California, right next to San Bernardino in the Inland Empire. Super thrilled. This, this, this site was a signal to the industry of what is possible. Our optimism around the future of commercial vehicle electrification and how the industry can rely on public infrastructure public infrastructure for electrification success. The station is the first of what will become our nationwide network and is the anchor point for our Los Angeles to Las Vegas corridor, as well as servicing drayage operations from the Port of Long Beach to the Inland Empire. In the coming weeks, we're gonna announce our next corridor. And with every new site, we're not just driving charging solutions and building industry solutions for the industry. We're driving economic development, strengthening local communities, and building the future of clean freight transportation. Second, earlier this month, uh, we also announced a strategic partnership with Volvo Trucking, making Green Lane the first fully integrated partner with Volvo's EMSP open charge application. This integration enables seamless, reliable charging solutions for Volvo's customers, allowing Volvo drivers to be able, through the Volvo open charge app, to find, reserve, and start a charge and transact with all Green Lane stations. This partnership also demonstrates our view and our vision of Green Lane Network of being interoperable with all vehicle OEMs and, and being agnostic to all trucks. Thirdly, we announced, along with our opening night, our new partnership with our first carrier, Navoya. We're really super happy that they'll begin domiciling trucks next week at our Colton facility, including tractor trailer parking and running their first fleet operations on the Green Lane Network marking the first of many fleets that we're gonna be servicing as we grow this across the country. With that also, I have some breaking news. I'm also proud to share that we've teamed up with Einride, a pioneer in autonomous as well as electric freight transportation to start running their fleet on the Green Lane Network. Einride is transforming how goods and services are moving with cutting edge solutions that make commercial freight transportation cleaner, smarter, and more efficient. We're thrilled to have you guys on board, and they're here today. Thank you, Sean. It's been an incredible ride over the last 18 months, and taking Green Lane to market and seeing our vision become a reality is just thrilling. Uh, we're taking the steps towards building out the largest and most reliable network, technically advanced network, which you're gonna see in a few moments across North America. At Green Lane, we believe that streamlining the transition to electric fleets, we are providing a future-ready solutions that keep goods and services moving across the country and driving meaningful progress towards zero emission freight transportation. So with that said, today I'm excited to show you what's next. With that, I'll hand it over to Naz Bandasar, our Chief Operating Officer, to give a look at what makes the Green Lane site special and what fleets can expect when you actually come to Green Lane to charge. Naz? Thank you, Patrick. So at Green Lane, we're building more than just public charging stations. We're building an entire experience designed for commercial drivers and fleets. Our Green Lane Center features two types of high power chargers, 12 pull through lanes with 400 kilowatt chargers and liquid cooled cables to optimize throughput for heavy duty trucks, and 29 bobtail chargers at 180 kilowatts for overnight parking and slip seating fleets all backed by 24 seven telephone and customer on online support. So drivers and fleet managers can always speak to a human. But it's not just about the hardware and amazing customer service and support. It's about the experience. And we want to ensure the best with driver amenities that include a comfortable lounge, food and drink, parking, storage, and even dedicated office spaces for those who need an operational hub. And of course, we prioritize security with cameras, controlled entry, 
and lighting to ensure driver safety 24 seven. Our facilities are staffed by an operations manager to guide and assist the drivers and looking ahead, we've designed our site with scalability in mind so that we can easily add megawatt charging and vehicle and OEM specific interoperability support as the industry evolves. But Colton is only the beginning. Green Lane is building a nationwide network of fast chargers, charging stations with the technology to scale your business. We're already working on additional sites, additional corridors, and site upgrades, such as integrating solar, best distributed energy, and megawatt charging, while continuing to support fleet electrification. We're focused on making charging as seamless and stress-free as possible for our drivers and fleet managers. And that's where our tech suite comes in. So to show you what that experience looks like firsthand, I'm gonna hand it over to our Chief Technology Officer, Raj Javeri. Thank you, Tanas. How's everyone doing here? You guys waiting for this? You excited? All right. So to make electric freight forwarding work, charging must be easy and predictable. Greenlane's technology ecosystem is powered by an AI energy management system that powers three key tools, our fleet portal, driver app, and a suite of APIs that easily integrate with customer legacy systems to simplify and streamline the charging experience. With reservations, drivers can count on, on having public charging available when they need it, ensuring stations and energy are ready specifically for them to keep their operations running smoothly. But most importantly, the charger's HMI screens will actually show a reserve status, preventing anyone to take up their space on those reserve times, as well as we have smart lanes signs that will change on available status to ensure drivers do not pull up to lanes that are already reserved or in use. This is a rarity in public charging setting. Most reservation systems they have it in the front end of the software, but when a driver pulls in or an ad hoc driver pulls in, it shows the charger as available, but then they're denied of having a charge and they have no clue why. And this is the first time we're gonna have an end-to-end -end reservation system that actually shows on the HMI that is reserved. So today we're gonna give you a live demo from booking a charging session right here at ACT to starting the charge on site at beautiful, sunny Colton, California. From the fleet portal, a fleet dispatcher can easily reserve a charger for a specific truck and driver, choosing location, reservation time, vehicle, and driver. This experience is also can be available through APIs if it's easily integrated into your legacy systems. So this way you don't have to learn a brand new technology. The application allows you to schedule reoccurring sessions for members up to six months in advance. You can also speak to our 24 seven call center to make changes or schedule. So on that note, let's get it started. So as you can see, we have our fleet portal here and you know, any, any existing fleet manager can have that up. Oh. Forgot to hit escape and the show, there we go. So as you can see, Colton, California, you can see all the details there. Just gonna quickly go to reservation. You can see all your upcoming today reservations. I can just add a reservation. It's select my site. We have both bobtail and pull through lanes. Um, you see all the site information, especially our beautiful driver lounge. You can have any refreshments and food there. I hit next step. Do a quick charge. Oh. There we go. Do a 30 minute charge, say 3.30. Next up. If you have a root ID associated with it, you just type it in here. We already have a Navoya Freightliner in Cascadia out there and then our director of customer operations Josh Copenjohn is playing the driver already at Colton I hit reserve 
And what the system's gonna do is assign you the lane that's gonna be available and it'll inform the driver automatically what lane they should go to. So on that note, let's go live. And there's Josh right there. Hey Josh, how's it going? Hey Rob, tell everyone at that. Just got some push notifications. There we go. So go ahead and um, push on the notification. As you can see, you can start either with your mobile app, but I think Josh is gonna start it with something different. What are you gonna start it with? Got my green lane RFID right here. All right, there you go. So Josh, can you show the HMI? Yep, we got it right here. It's got a pulse connector, and you can see that four day is reserved. Yeah, so as you can see, an end-to-end -end reservation system right here, and we also have smart signs that's gonna show reserved as well. So go ahead and start a charge, Josh. Yep, and it's pulled the connector. You can see the air light is also yellow for reserve. The great thing is that we have dual connectors. So as you can see, eCascadia has dual ports, so you can charge even faster, or you can charge your trailer as well. And as you can see, the authentication is only to Josh himself. No one else can authenticate this. And all of our chargers are CTEP compliant. So you see all the details regarding your charging session, the power that's gonna be delivered. There we go. And there you have it. Yeah. Josh, what are you gonna do now? Head over to the research lab and grab a coffee. See y'all later. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Josh. So there you have it, an end-to-end -end reservation system. Um, first in the industry, uh, we can, you know, for those who's joining in LinkedIn Live, thank you. We do have a full VR experience at the booth, and our great product managers has been working day and night building this feature out. And thank you for all coming. Welcome to the next generation of fleet charging.